Hello. Today I want to answer one of the most common questions from our audience. Why do conductors need a stick? My name is Carlos Andres Botero and this is our music. A podcast to unlock your imagination to the possibilities of classical music. I hope you're having an inspiring week. A baton properly used is an instrument of meaning. Its movements conveys musical ideas to those who create the sound. Despite its striking resemblance with a magic wand, it is certainly not imbued with supernatural music enhancing abilities. The birth of the orchestra took place when the genre of opera was created around the 1600s. Soon enough, everyone realized that they needed someone to keep together these larger forces. When not leading from the keyboard or their violin, conductors often use a six foot long wooden staff that will bang against the floor to keep the beat. As occupational hazards go, Jean Baptiste Lilly had the worst of injuries. In 1647, during a performance, he accidentally struck his own foot. The wound became soon gangrenous and ultimately led to his death three months later. As orchestras achieved independence from the opera, and the number of players required to perform a symphony is scaled up quickly, the role of a professional conductor was born. Many composers took up the baton from time to time, but it was Mendelssohn, Berlioz, Wagner and Mahler who excelled at it and helped cementing the role and its modern technique. They all used the baton as a way to enlarge and enhance their physical movements. Even though there is not a standard practice in place, the baton normally is between 10 and 14 inches long and few grams in weight. Some conductors might choose a bigger one and some even toothpicks. From time to time, the baton is simply unnecessary. In general, you want it to be balanced in the point where it leaves your hand. It also helps if the players can perceive it correctly. It should be easy to see, easy to hold and subtle enough to avoid distractions. In the end, as a tool, it is there so that we can achieve inspiring performances together. Thanks for listening. Please remember this space was created for you. Leave your comments below and don't forget to subscribe. Hear you next time.